When Susan Yara asks how you achieve this melasma transformation, you give her the details. Let's talk about it. First of all, thank you so much to my patient for allowing me to share her skin and her story. And just so you know where this video is headed, this is how we got her skin to look after four months of working together. But let's come back here because I think context is really important. So she came to me for help with her complexion because she had had three kids and with each pregnancy, the pigmentation on her face had gotten worse. The fact that this pigmentation got worse with her pregnancies is really important to know because this is melasma and I could see it very easily being misdiagnosed as just freckles and traditional sun damage. And it's so important to have the correct diagnosis before you start treatment. Aside from her letting me know that this got worse during pregnancies, which is often a clue that it's melasma, you can see here on her forehead, she has these more confluent patches of brown rather than the more freckle looking spots down on her cheeks. And that is the clue. We were able to take her skin from this to this with three main interventions. The first being excellent sun protection, application of sunscreen every single day, reapplied when outside and a wide brim hat when outdoors. Two, the application of a prescription medication containing tretinoin and 8% hydroquinone every single night for four months. And three, a series of clear and brilliant laser treatments. Something I want to make very clear though, is we have treated her melasma, but have not cured it. There is no cure. So now she needs a maintenance regimen to keep this excellent result. 